The Crossroads Arts District is one of many districts and art walks in Kansas City and is a community experiencing extraordinary growth and national recognition as one of the top arts communities in the nation. On the first Fridays of each month, an estimated 12,000 visitors enjoy the art and other offerings of more than 60 Crossroads Arts District galleries and boutiques that open their doors. Not only is the Crossroads a symbol for Kansas City's appreciation for the arts, it is also a lively area where activities and endeavors can range from live concerts to street vendors to art performances, grassroots and guerrilla art sales, and general parties and celebrations. One example of an excellent space is the Leedy Volkus Art Center, which not only houses one of the largest and most stunning exhibition spaces, often exhibiting national and international artists, but also has a multitude of artist studios available to emerging artists at very affordable rates. These are live-in studios where artists can work on their art 24 hours a day and have the comfort of other artists living alongside them, enabling them to share ideas, borrow tools, have group critiques, but most importantly, form a true community. Another example of artist studios is in the Arts Incubator of Kansas City. The Arts Incubator is a nonprofit organization dedicated to working with emerging artists in the development of their careers. The Incubator is a unique space offering studios, exhibit space, and shared resources. In addition to business workshops and consulting, the Arts Incubator provides affordable, quality studio space. The Arts Incubator now has 32 resident members and brand new space for 55 artist studios as well as maintaining shared shops, community workspaces, and two full running galleries. As so many artists have moved to the Crossroads area within a mere few years, dozens of new shops are popping up at a rapid rate. From clothing and accessories to hair salons and artist-run businesses, there is plenty to choose from in this newer, hipper part of town. West 18th Street is an amazing example of this. It started with a local coffee shop and snack bar called YJ's when David Ford, a graduate of the Art Institute, expanded his mission, taking over an entire block and opening up opportunities for very young artists and entrepreneurs, sometimes as young as 23, to start their own businesses. These artists had the opportunity to transform small retail spaces into incredibly unique venues for their merchandise and handmade products. Some of these artists have already been featured in national and international magazines such as Elle, Spin, Bust, Women's Wear Daily, Glamour Magazine, Nylon Japan, Rolling Stone, and many others. With Ford doing so much for the crossroads and local artists, you rarely see him relaxing at YJ's with his patrons, but they are all part of the amazing community which is very apt to helping one another out in order for everyone to succeed. It is a style that's very unique to Kansas City, and one which will prove successful for artists for years to come.